So now what I will do, I will create a one more directory. Uh, I will start by creating a directory mkdir ayush. Okay. I have created Ayush and uh, now what I have to do uh, I have to again create a uh, more directory in Ayush CD Ayush okay mkdir Ayush 2 okay Ayush 2 now we are done again I will go on the home directory and what I will do I will uh, create one more directory mkdir um, test 67 Okay, so here you can see Ayush has been created already in the Ayush so directory we have another Ayush 2 and text 67 where it is, oh yeah, here it, this is one, okay. So I will perform here ls and now you can see all the directory which we have created. Now what I have to tell, tell you like uh, to remove this directory, uh, the command is rmdir, okay, remove directory. So there is a one thing in this like uh, uh, let me clear this all. Uh, if directory is empty, okay. If like uh, suppose this directory test 67, there is nothing. This is empty directory. So in this case, we can easily use RMDIR. Okay, we can easily use it. But if directory is not empty, suppose in this case, I use I use to. So in this case when we will do rmdir so what will happen like it will uh, like it will not delete that particular directory it will show you the error like uh, directory is not empty okay but when you will go in the ayush directory and when you will try to delete ayush2 then it can be easily deleted why the reason behind is this like ayush2 is empty okay i hope you got this point like uh, how rmdir command works so uh, now our job is to just delete the directory and learn the things okay so let's start so what we will do uh, ls now I will first try to delete the test 67 test 67 okay so now what will happen I will hit just enter and now boom so your test 67 has been deleted okay now again we will try to do ls here and so you will not see anywhere like test 67 is there now now what we will do and yeah one more shortcut I want to tell you that we, uh, for clearing the terminal if you do clear then it will clear obviously but uh, there is also one more shortcut like control plus L automatic derogate clear okay so now what we have to do we have to remove the directory Ayush okay now let's see what happens fail to remove Ayush directory not empty okay obviously directory is not empty we know like there is another folder in Ayush so what we will do now we will go in Ayush directory and then I will try to first delete Ayush 2 okay we have deleted and there is no any directory now what I will do I will go back in the home directory and I will delete Ayush okay so Ayush has been deleted okay so suppose if there is many folders and directories like uh, suppose there in Ayush there is Ayush 2 to Ayush 100 okay or in that uh, particular directory there are other more directories okay so you have to delete this so this is very tedious work like uh, uh, like it's not easy to do one by one okay so like uh, the solution for that is that like if we will use some flags with it okay so now again let me create a directory I will use hyphen p option if you have watched previous video then you will get it what is hyphen p and all these things so I am going to create uh, not test let's create with Ayush1 Ayush2 Ayush3 uh, so what, what uh, will happen here like in Ayush1 there will be Ayush2 in Ayush2 there will be Ayush3 so you can check here uh, Ayush1 Ayush2 and I say and in I say there will be nothing it will be empty directory so now what I have to do I have to delete this whole directory in single command so what I will do there are multiple ways I will tell you everything each one by one the more uh, different ways okay so we will use rmdir slash s okay and then we will just provide the directory name Ayush1 okay 
so uh, what this command will do basically it will delete the whole the directory from the root to the end like child like it will start from ayush and it will end to the ayush 3 and it will delete the whole file structure and uh, with this command it will ask you for the permission like uh, you have you will need to enter yes or no whether you want to delete or not like just like a confirmation message it will ask for you let's check what happens okay uh, it's showing no such file or directory why uh, one minute let me check with this hyphen help whether it works in Ubuntu or not okay no, sorry we can use hyphen P option for that okay sorry what we'll do rmdir hyphen P Ayush 1 I think we will need to provide whole path okay Ayush 3 so we can easily have we have deleted easily in this way also we can use rmdir in this way okay but there is also one way uh, that slash says I will need to just check with the Google uh, why this command uh, didn't work uh, not working with Ubuntu like I have used this command earlier it was working in my Linux machine uh, let me check with it um, and also let's go with the rmdir slash sh okay google is your friend buddy like if you will stuck somewhere uh, then this is your only friend where you will get the help okay okay so here is the like documentation of microsoft then if it is microsoft then like it should be correct here slash is what it's saying delete the directory tree this is why direct and all subdirectory including all files okay we were correct and this rmdir slash s test to remove a directory name test and all its subdirectory okay we were doing the same thing i didn't get uh, why it's not working in ubuntu uh like there may be some reason uh here you can see uh, like there is uh, there may be okay uh, leave it uh, I will try one once more let's check it happens or not I will try to create again the same directory I will just hit the uh, what was the command rmdir slashes and uh, are you shown it is there okay 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 fail to remove okay if I do forcefully then what happens okay it's not working even so now what is the options to delete the whole directory in a single command like uh, slash has failed in Ubuntu I don't know why we will figure it out later uh, but now what is the other way so there is a way so what we will do we can we use the rm command okay with the help of this command uh, we can easily delete all the files like in a single command what we will use the flag with it rm hyphen rf okay and then ayush one done we are done buddy like rf stands for recursively and f stands for forcefully we can e easily use this rm command to remove these directories in a one single command okay so uh, that's all for um, today I hope you got it like uh, how we can delete the directories uh, in this uh, by using a particular single command or by one by one command like basically uh, in the like uh, real world uh, we basically use this rm hyphen rf okay we use it uh, because uh, like uh, whenever we create a directory it will not be empty like you can get it you can relate it with it like whenever you create then you create it for some kind of purpose that's why so we can easily use this rm hyphen rf command for this uh, removing directory okay so that's all for today uh, i hope you liked it uh, i hope and uh, if you have any query then please you can ask us in comment section and yeah please do like share and subscribe our channel and yeah thank you thank you for watching this video